वेलकम लर्नर्स टुडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग ऑन अ कार्बोहाइड्रेट कंटेनिंग ड्रग एंड नेचुरल फार्मास्यूटिकल एड्स और एक्सपीरियंट ट्रेगाकॉन लर्निंग आउटकम ऑफ दिस टुडे लेक्चर्स आर स्टूडेंट्स विल बी एबल टू डिफाइन बायोलॉजिकल सोर्स ऑफ ट्रेगाकॉन लिस्ट ऑकरेंस एंड डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन सॉरी डिस्क्राइब कलेक्शन ऑफ गम आइडेंटिफाई फिजिकल कैरेक्टर्स एक्सप्लेन केमिकल कॉन्स्टिट्यूएंट्स एंड यूजेस एंड फाइन केमिकल टेस्ट एस्ट्रगल एज गमी फर और सोर्स ऑफ ट्रागाकंड सो ट्रागाकंड इज बेसिकली अ गम एंड व्हिच इज ऑप्टेन फ्रॉम दिस पर्टिकुलर प्लांट एस्ट्रगल एज गमी फर Uh, it is actually a unorganized drug uh, gum uh, and that is obtained from this particular plant here you can see the image of this astragalus gummifer and the left side you can see the uh, herbarium of this particular gum and this is the image of the gum itself and uh, in raw condition and this one is the powder of this particular gum synonym of this gum is gum tragacanth or milk bhech um let's look on the uh, taxonomic profile of this particular plant uh kingdom plantae sub kingdom trachiobionata uh super division is permatophyta division magnoliophyta class magnoliopsida sub class rosidi order favellus family fabaceae previously it was considered as a leguminosae family but now it is this is known as the fabaceae is the same family um, of peas pulses uh, species is astragalus gummifer level gum tragacanth name of the plant is the gum tragacanth and milk bhech so i told you that it is the gum and the biological source of this unorganized drug it is an air hardened gummy exudate flowing naturally uh, or by insertion from the trunk and branches of astragalus gummifer uh, family fabaceae or leguminosae this drug is actually indigenous to the iraq iran greece turkey and mainly this plant is available in high altitude or sometimes in the desert also and in india few species are available in garhwal and kumaon region and the central punjab region also collection and preparation the gums are exuding immediately after injury and therefore the gum is already preformed in the plant unlike acacia acacia the gum exudes uh, after certain period of time of injury because injury induces the gum exudation but here that is already prepared so gum exuding immediately up after injury the gums can be collected from the first year but more preferred time is uh, for good quality gum Uh, can be tapped in the next year second year onwards so for collection of the gum a waste shaped piece of wood is introduced for incision purposes by the collector and that gives the force uh, to open the incision and gum will flow more freely after this um, force and basically the gums are collected after 2 days of incision although um, Uh, after just after incision gums uh, started flowing but uh, more preferable time for collection is 2 days after the incision physical characters the colors are white or pale yellowish white uh, odorless that is available in ribbon or flake or uh, in powder form the taste is mucilaginous taste and it's it is insoluble in water it swells in water but very small portions also dissolve um, mostly we can get a suspension uh, on uh, by heating this particular gum 
so chemical constituent as i told you that uh, it is a gum gum means the polymer of sugar and uronic acid tragacanth when we dissolve it in water certain portions are soluble and if we analyze this water soluble portion or fraction that fraction is known as tragacanthin chemically that is tragacanthin and water insoluble fraction is known as basorin so it's a polymer of sugar and uronic acid which on hydrolyzed uh, hydrolyzes by acid it produce it produces a galactouronic acid d galactopyranose l arabino furanose and d xylopyranose let's see the chemical test of this uh, drug so first the solution of chloramine uh, solution of 0.5% w by v uh, solution is taken and to it uh, 0.5 ml hydrochloric acid is given and <coughs> then heat it for 30 minutes on water bath and that helps in the hydrolysis process of this gum and resulting in the with the hydrolysis we can take it in the two different test tubes for first part uh, we can add 1.5 ml of sodium hydroxide solution and filling solution uh, that is filling a and b and heated on water bath and due to presence of reducing sugar it shows the rate precipitate that is mainly the galactose and other reducing sugar it shows the rate precipitate but to the second part um, if we add barium chloride solution no precipitate is observed in agar we observe that uh, white precipitate is observed due to the presence of sulfur but here no precipitate is observed another test is when tragacanth is boiled with 10% pericloride solution deep yellow precipitate is observed this is one of the important identification test which distinguish tragacanth from other uh, gums like acacia and agar powder drug is uh, another test is powder drug is uh, warmed with 5% aqueous potassium or sodium hydroxide solution so alkaline solutions uh, um, when we add alkaline solution and one is it produces canary yellow color to 0.1 g of powder drug if we add n by 50 iodine strong iodine solution then we can observe the green color so these are the chemical test for the identification of the tragacan and the uses of this gum this gum is used as pharmaceutical aid and mostly it is used as a preferable suspending agent it sometimes used as binding agent for tablet it is used uh, as stabilizer for food jam jelly ice cream externally the thing is used uh, for lotion and it is also used uh, in different spermicidal jelly formulations so this all about the tragacanth thank you and happy learning